Okay. So now we have a question here. A machine is depreciated the rate of 20% on reducing balance, which means the bad value uh, at the end of every year on that further depreciation takes place. The original cost of the machine was 1 lakh and its ultimate scrap value was rupees 30,000. Effective life of the machine. So let's jot down the uh, question. So you have scrap value is equal to cost into 1 minus d raised to 5. So scrap value is of course 30,000. Original value is 100,000. Depreciation rate is 20%. So 1 minus 0 0.2 raised to 5. So it's going to be 30,000 by 1 lakh. So 3 by 10, 0 0.3 is 0. Sorry, we don't have F. We need to find N. Sorry. So it's n we need to find is 0 0.8 raised to n. So we need to find 0 0.8 raised to n. So what do we do? We take 0 0.8 into itself 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So it is, if it is 0 0.8 raised to 6, it is 0 0.26 odd, and if it is 0 0.8 raised to 5, it is 0 0.32. So it's between n is clearly greater than 5 and less than 6 because 0 0.8 raised to 5 is 0. Um, is 0 0.32 and this is 0. Point, raised to 6 is 0. 0.26. So among these it has to be something between 5 and 6 here. So among these it is 5.4 years maybe approximately. So let's see what we have it right. Yes, quite true. Furthermore, the useful life of a machine is estimated to be 10 years and cost is rupees 10,000. Rate of depreciation is 10%, the scrap value at the end of its life is what? So you have the depreciation rate, that is the cost is 10,000 into 1 minus 0 0.1 raised to 10. So which will turn out to be 10,000 into 0 0.9 raised to 10 is what we need to find out. If the rate of depreciation is 10%, so it's 0 0.9. Sorry, 0 0.9 into 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So it turns out to be roughly around 10,000 into 0 0.34867 and dot, which will work out to 3486.78. Among these, the closest is this. So we can approximate it to 3486. So the scrap value is going to be 3486. Yes, we are right. Further ahead, we have a question which says a machine depreciates at 10% of its value at the beginning of a year. The cost and scrap value realized at the time of sale being 23,240 and rupees 9000 respectively. So you have the scrap value that is 9000 is equal to cost that is 23240 into 1 minus d that is 1 minus 0 0.1 raised to n. So it's going to be 900, 900 divided by 2324 which roughly this divided 900 by 2324 works out to be 0 0.9 raised to n which will turn out to be roughly 0 0.3876 is 0 0.9 raised to n. So let's see what this works out to be 0 0.9 into 2 times, 3 times, 4 times, 5 times, 6 times, 7 times. 8 times, 9 times, yes, 
it's roughly around 9 times it works out to be 0 0.3875 watt. So 0 0.9 raised to 5 is approximately 0 0.3876. So N will turn out to be 9. N turns out to be 9. So the number of years, sorry, this is not 5, this is 9. This is 9. Let's just check it up once more. 0 0.9. Yes, it's 9. 0 0.9 raised to 9 is 0 0.3876. That is in 9 years, the value would turn out to be 9000. So our correct answer is 9. Right, we have it right here. Furthermore, okay, so we have a machine worth rupees 4,90,740. is depreciated at 15% on its opening value. When would its value reduce to 2 lakhs? So it's going to be again scrap value is 2 lakh is equal to 4,90,740 into 1 minus D is 0 0.15 raised to N. So we have 20,000 divided by 4,49,074 is 0 0.85 raised to N. So we have 20 divided by 49074, which works out to be around 0 0.407547, not not, is 0 0.85 raised to N. So we need to see 0 0.85 into 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. So 0 0.85 raised to 6 gives you 0 0.37 and 0 0.85 raised to 4 gives 0 0.44. So obvious raised to 5 gives you 0 0.44. So this value is between 5 years and 6 years. So among these options, the only option between 5 and 6 years is this. So the option is roughly N is going to be around 5 years plus, which is 5 years, 7 months approximately. Right, we have it that way. Okay, similarly, <clears throat> a machine worth 4,90,740 is depreciated at 15% of its opening value each year. When will its value reduce by 90%? So that means even if this value was not given, so the value becomes 90% of the original, that means scrap value is 0 0.9. It reduces by 90%, that means it becomes less by 90%, so it eventually is going to just become 0 0.1 of its original value. So it's like telling 0 0.1 times 4,90,740 is its scrap value. Cost continues to remain 4,90,740 into 1 minus 15%, 0 0.15 raised to N. So this of course gets cancelled. So we do it now. So eventually 0 0.1 is 0 0.85 raised to N. So this N lies between 14 and 15. When it is 14, 885 raised to 14 is 0 0.10 odd. And when it is 0 0.85 raised to 15 is 0 0.08. So N is between 14 and 15. So then the option among these is 14 years and 2 months approximately. So hence this would be the right answer. Okay, we do have it. Okay, now we have it uh, 
The cost of machinery is rupees 1,25,000 if its useful life is estimated to be 20 years and the rate of depreciation is 10%, then scrap value of the machinery is given to be is what among these? So life is 20 years. So we have here cost is 1,25,000. So scrap value has to be found out cost into 1 minus 0 0.1 raised to 20 which turns out to be 1,25,000 into 0 0.9 raised to 20. So now this again is 1,25,000 into 0 0.1215. So turns out to be roughly 15,000 187 and a few odd paise and 50 paise. So approximately is 15,187 rupees. This 15187 is the answer. Okay, and we have it that.